AMD and Intel have both recently put out new CPU models in their mainstream processor families. On AMD's side, that's the Ryzen 3600 XT, 3800 XT, and 3900 XT, each of which are slightly faster models than the previous X series, with approximately 1 to 200 megahertz increases in maximum boost speeds. Intel went the opposite direction and put out the Core i9-10850K, which is a slightly slower version of the existing 10900K, at 100 megahertz lower base and maximum turbo boost speeds. We wanted to see how these changes impact real-world performance, so we ran all of these CPUs through two rendering tests, Cinebench and V-Ray Next. In both cases, we found the Ryzen processors gained about 1-2% performance over their previous models, and the Intel processor lost about 2-3% performance. But in real-world usage, those differences are so small you wouldn't notice unless you were sitting there with a stopwatch. So our advice is to go with whichever processor has the best availability in your area and is the best price. If you can get the faster models for the same price, great. If not, though, you won't notice the difference. I should also point out, though, that with any of these CPUs, they are not necessarily the best option for rendering in the first place. That honor goes to AMD's Threadripper 3rd Gen processors. If you want to see more details about our test results, please check out the full article linked below. Thank you very much.